Okay, here at the end, there's one thing I was going to do, but uh, I believe I'm going to let the customer, or the engine builder, do this one part. Is I've got the stud in here, and as you can see, part of this stud is sticking in the port. Now, that is an airflow hindrance. You can see it right here. So since the area that's going to be holding it is only from there up, that's where I raised the roof almost a quarter of an inch going in. What I typically do on this deal, I don't have a, a blue one. I have actually an orange one somewhere in the shop. But anyway, I'll go in here and take my orange marker and just... Uh, Basically, go in there and mark the threads right there, okay? And that's going to brighten them up. Now, after that, you can remove them, and it's going to show where I painted it orange right there on that thread. You uh, take it out. You want to take it out, remove the stud, and then you take your cutting saw or a hand cutter and cut it straight on that thread and then re-tap it and thread it and blend it so that when you go in here and tighten it down you don't have no overhang because that right there could cost you some CFM. It's going to hurt what I did on the roof. So I'm going to let the engine builder do that and trust him to do that part of it. Uh, I have told the customer and he's aware that the engine builder has to go in there and trim that down. Alright, so let's go ahead and see, see the port and see what we got left to right.